organisms of many species are specialized into male and female varieties, each known as a sex. One two sexual reproduction involves the combining and mixing of genetic traits. Specialized cells known as gametes combine to form offspring that inherit traits from each parent. The gametes produced by an organism define its sex. Males produce small gametes e.g. spermatozoa or sperm in animals while females produce large gametes ova or egg cells. Individual organisms, which produce both male and female gametes are termed hermaphroditic. Two three gametes can be identical in form and function known as isogamy, but, in many cases, an asymmetry has evolved such that two different types of gametes heterogametes exist known as anisogamy for five. Physical differences are often associated with the different sexes of an organism. These sexual dimorphisms can reflect the different reproductive pressures the sexes experience. For instance, mate choice and sexual selection can accelerate the evolution of physical differences between the sexes. Among humans and other mammals, males typically carry an X and a Y chromosome XY, whereas females typically carry two X chromosomes XX, which are a part of the XY sex determination system. Other animals have various sex determination systems, such as the ZW system in birds, the X0 system in insects, and various environmental systems, for example in reptiles and crustaceans. Fungi may also have more complex allelic mating systems, with sexes not accurately described as male, female, or hermaphroditic 6. Contents 1 Overview 2 Evolution 3 Sexual Reproduction 3.1 Animals 3.2 Plants 3.3 Fungi 4 Sex Determination 4.1 Genetic 4.2 Non-Genetic 5 Sexual Dimorphism 6 See also 7 References 8 Further Reading 9 External Links Overview The male gamete sperm fertilizing the female gamete oven One of the basic properties of life is reproduction, the capacity to generate new individuals, and sex is an aspect of this process. Life has evolved from simple stages to more complex ones, and so have the reproduction mechanisms. Initially the reproduction was a replicating process that consists in producing new individuals that contain the same genetic information as the original or parent individual. This mode of reproduction is called asexual, and it is still used by many species, particularly unicellular, but it is also very common in multicellular organisms, including many of those with sexual reproduction. 7. In sexual reproduction, the genetic material of the offspring comes from two different individuals. Bacteria reproduce asexually, but undergo a process by which a part of the genetic material of an individual donor is transferred to another recipient. 8. Disregarding intermediates, the basic distinction between asexual and sexual reproduction is the way in which the genetic material is processed. Typically, prior to an asexual division, a cell duplicates its genetic information content and then divides. This process of cell division is called mitosis. In sexual reproduction, there are special kinds of cells that divide without prior duplication of its genetic material in a process named meiosis. The resulting cells are called gametes and contain only half the genetic material of the parent cells. These gametes are the cells that are prepared for the sexual reproduction of the organism. Nine sex comprises the arrangements that enable sexual reproduction and has evolved alongside the reproduction system, starting with similar gametes isogamy and progressing to systems that have different gamete types, such as those involving a large female gamete ovum and a small male gamete sperm. Ten. In complex organisms, the sex organs are the parts that are involved in the production and exchange of gametes in sexual reproduction. Many species, both plants and animals, have sexual specialization, and their populations are divided into male and female individuals. Conversely, there are also species in which there is no sexual specialization, and the same individuals both contain masculine and feminine reproductive organs, and they are called hermaphrodites. This is very frequent in plants 11. Evolution Main Article, Evolution of Sexual Reproduction Different Forms of Anisogamy A. Anisogamy of modal cells B. Ugamy egg cell and sperm cell C. Anisogamy of non-modal cells egg cell and sperm -isha. Different Forms of Isogamy A. Isogamy of modal cells B. Isogamy of non-modal cells C. Conjugation Sexual reproduction first probably evolved about a billion years ago within ancestral single-celled eukaryotes. 12. The reason for the evolution of sex, and the reason s it has survived to the present, are still matters of debate. Some of the many plausible theories include, that sex creates variation among offspring, sex helps in the spread of advantageous traits, that sex helps in the removal of disadvantageous traits, and that sex facilitates repair of germline DNA. Sexual reproduction is a process specific to eukaryotes, organisms, whose cells contain a nucleus and mitochondria. In addition to animals, plants, and fungi, 
Other eukaryotes e.g. the malaria parasite also engage in sexual reproduction. Some bacteria use conjugation to transfer genetic material between cells, while not the same as sexual reproduction, this also results in the mixture of genetic traits. The defining characteristic of sexual reproduction in eukaryotes is the difference between the gametes and the binary nature of fertilization. Multiplicity of gamete types within a species would still be considered a form of sexual reproduction. However, no third gamete type is known in multicellular plants or animals 13, 14, 15. While the evolution of sex dates to the prokaryote or early eukaryote stage, 16 the origin of chromosomal sex determination may have been fairly early in eukaryotes. In animals there are four systems of sex determination, which depend on a special chromosome. In the X0 sex determination system males have one X chromosome X0, while females have two XX. This system is found in most arachnids, insects such as silverfish Apteriga, dragonflies Palaenoptera and grasshoppers Exoptriga, and some nematodes, crustaceans, and gastropods 17-18 in the Z0 sex determination system males have two Z chromosomes whereas females have one. This system is found in several species of moths 1920 in the ZW sex determination system males have two Z chromosomes, whereas females have one Z chromosome and one W chromosome. Therefore it is the female gamete that determines the sex of the offspring. This system is used by birds, some fish, and some crustaceans. In the XY sex determination system females have two X chromosomes, whereas males have one X chromosome and one Y chromosome. Therefore it is the male gamete that determines the sex of the offspring. This system is used by most mammals, 21 but also some insects 22 no genes are shared between the avian ZW and mammal XY chromosomes, 23 and from a comparison between chicken and human, the Z chromosome appeared similar to the autosomal chromosome 9 in human, rather than X or Y, suggesting that the ZW and XY sex determination systems do not share an origin, but that the sex chromosomes are derived from autosomal chromosomes of the common ancestor of birds and mammals. A paper from 2004 compared the chicken Z chromosome with platypus X chromosomes, and suggested that the two systems are related 24. 